In this presentation we're going to look at binary strings. So here's the question. Let S be the set A, B, C and D. Describe briefly how each subset of S can be represented by a unique 4-bit binary string. Then we write down the string corresponding to the subset A, C and D and the subset corresponding to the string 0, 1, 1, 0. Also we are asked what is the total number of subsets of S. So let's look at the first question here. Let S be the set A, B, C, D. Describe briefly how each subset of S will be described by a unique 4-bit string. So let's consider a subset of S to be B and D. Okay. Now here, if for this subset, B is present and D is present, but A and C are not present. So how would we sort of represent this information? Well, what we could do is if the is, uh, the element is present, we would put a 1, and if the element is not present, we would have a 0. So in this particular case, we would write this as 0, 1, 0, 1. Uh, another example, let's say, would be the empty set. So in this particular case we would have none of the elements would be present so in this case uh, 0 for A, 0 for B, 0 for C and 0 for D and let's just look at the another case again A, B, C and D in this case each uh, element is present so for each case there is a corresponding one so in this case it would be 1 1 1 1 so that's straightforward enough. If an element is present, we uh, have 1. If an element is absent, we have 0. So moving on. Write down the string corresponding to the subset A, C, and D. Well, here A is present, so that's a 1. B is not present, so that's a 0. And C and D are present, so that is 1 and 1 respectively. So just to be clear, A, C, and D. Now, in this next case, 0, 1, 1, 0, well, we have A is not present there, B is present, and C is present. So, that is the subset corresponding to the string 0, 1, 1, 0. I've just noticed that the T got knocked out there. So, anyway, moving on. Finally, uh, what is the total number of subset of subsets of S? Well, this is a question that relates to another matter called power sets. Okay. So, uh, I have made a separate video of that, or power sets, but you can have a look at that. Otherwise, the cardinality of set S is 4. So, what is the total number of subsets of S? Well, what is the power set? What is the cardinality, the power set of our S? Which we would write as uh, P of S. Well, that would be 2 to the power of 4. That would be 16. So there are 16 subsets of S. And that concludes our presentation.